can only get this in Canada. So tonight I'm actually having a little housewarming gathering. I'm really excited to have people over. The plan is to order some food. We're probably gonna drink some wine and it's just gonna be a nice little cozy night in with my girls. My guests are coming in a little bit. Oh. Uh, oh, wait, can you hear me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 손님들 인사 해. <laughs> a bit more voluminous. So who has experience with I this? I don't like it. Okay, I genuinely 진짜 mm -hmm. 몰라. You have to mm -hmm. aim it for the door, I think. Mm -hmm. But you you can hold it and pull it out. You don't have to go. Oh. You know what? You sound really experienced. So I'm gonna let oh, you I'm do it. I'm not. You you sound like you know what, what you're doing. What if I spill it? Thank you. And that is why I don't do it. <laughs> Let's I think, all right, yeah. Thank you for coming. Thanks for having yeah. us. Yeah. Congratulations, Delia. I couldn't, like, I couldn't Pizza. find it. Yeah. Oh shoot, I have to cross. Oh my gosh, hold on, wait. Okay, sorry, as I was saying, China is actually so exciting because a friend of mine from Toronto is visiting Korea. This is like the first time that a close friend of mine has come to Korea, so I'm so excited. I haven't seen her in, well, I guess since I moved here, and it's a year and a half now, and she's like one of the friends that I keep in contact with constantly, so I can't wait to show her around. I'm gonna meet her at her hotel now actually yay <laughs> reunited and it feels so good she smuggled stuff for me <laughs> oh my gosh my god ooh thank you Yes, you can only get this in Canada. Oh my gosh! Because <laughs> the air probably came out of somewhere. <laughs> I'm out here just studying Korean. I actually have class in a bit and I realized some of you are actually really curious about how I learned Korean and kind of more information about that. It's been almost three years for me and honestly, majority of my learning is very self-taught. I use so many different kinds of books from different schools, so many different apps, websites, YouTube videos, podcasts. Even watching Korean TV shows with the subtitles on is something that I've also done before too. I feel like when it comes to learning, it's up to you to find your own personal learning style and what works best for you. And I really want to introduce to you this language learning program from Story Learning. It's called Korean Uncovered. So this course teaches you beginner Korean in a very fun and natural way. Each module in this course is based on original Chinese stories where it's written in a very beginner-friendly way. So you'll first read and listen to the story. Then you'll have this in-depth lesson with Story Learning's native Korean teacher where they will be breaking down all the Korean grammar that was used in that story. So kind of like how when we're growing up, we read children's storybooks. It's the same idea. 
building from that kind of level up and then it's also really fun because it's easy to remember stories. This course is actually $297 but I've partnered up with Story Learning to give you guys a discount. If you click the link in my description box, you can get 33% off and that's $100 off. If this is the year where you told yourself you're gonna finally start learning Korean, I highly recommend you give Story Learning a try and do not miss out on this deal. If you do try it, let me know how it goes. I hope it works out for you. For me, I think I'm getting a little hungry actually, so I think I'm gonna go grab a bite to eat before I go out for class. Today I'm doing my first hike ever in Korea and it's so funny. We're doing Achasan and the moment we walked out of the station, it's all these Achashis in their hiking gear and it's so cute and we're just following them. Oh, I should have filmed that one. Oh, the mountain! Wow! Oh my gosh, they have matching hair. That's so cool. <laughs> This is the start of the hike and look how pretty it is. I'm so happy the weather today is so nice. We made it to the pavilion. This is a key lookout point. Oh my gosh, we see Lotte Tower! Wow. This is so beautiful. City meets nature. We made it! This is the highest part of this mountain, I guess, to 97 meters. After a hike, we're having some naengmyeon. That's so strange. All right, I'm gonna go for it. I really don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Just do like a... Just don't do too much. Just do like a... We're at the Gongjang Market and it's poppin'! 7 p.m. We're trying to find the Netflix Mandu Kaguksu lady for her. She wants to give that shop a try. Wow! It's so squishy, but we're gonna make it work. This is a really big portion. Similar to the one we had last time? Yeah, I mean, to be honest, it really does look similar, so I don't know. I mean, if they're all like traditional style, yeah. Mm. 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 Wow, in the same style. Same style. Mm. There's this huge line for this hot dog stall. It's the only one that's open in the market right now. But I think we're gonna wait in line. I like really, really want to have some. Thank you. Secure the hot dog. Yeah. Mm. Mm. My bite was just the dough. I didn't get the middle. It's good. Like Raph it. likes it. And she doesn't even like sweets. Mm. Currently in Myeongdong, the theme street, the main shopping area. It's really nice to see Myeongdong so like packed once again because during COVID it was so dead. Okay, so I just rode the train from Gangnam during rush hour and safe to say I will never do that ever again because that was like sardines. But anyway, right now I'm actually on my way to meet Maggie, I miss her baby, and only her baby, not Maggie, no, I'm just kidding. I of course miss Maggie too, so I'm really excited to see them. Eating dinner, but look who's here. Yeah, that's right, get back down. Is she smart? Oh, oh. oh. Ay -go. Ay -go. bless you. <laughs> just like mommy. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's so cute. Hey, she's smiling. I'm gonna steal her. Bye. I'm gonna bye, take bye. Her home. bye. I wish I could steal you. Actually, no, I don't. <laughs> I just want to yeah. steal you to play with, and then I'll give you back. End of the night. I'm having two people escort me. Just kidding. They're walking their dog. This is Cooper. Guess what? Today I'm back at this Hanu restaurant. It's my fifth time here, but I had to take my fellow 
guests here. And let me show you the beef. Wow, so marvelous. Oh my gosh, the owner gave us service. That's what it looks like. So nice. Right now we're at Shabu. Very excited. I want to learn a little bit of Korean language. I'm going to explain it in Korean. I'm going to eat a cereal in the morning, but I'm going to eat a cereal in the morning. I'm going to eat a cereal in the morning. I'm going to eat a cereal in the morning. I'm not going to eat a cereal in the morning. 어 되게 기대된다. 오늘의 아침 계란과 tater tots 그리고 Heinz ketchup입니다. 와 제가 대학교 다녔을 때 자주 먹은 아침은 바로 이거. 빨리 먹어야 돼. 음음 음. 음. I want to show you what I'm having for dinner tonight. This is a bowl of cauliflower rice and some beef stir-fried seasoned with garlic and soy sauce. And here I have a side of lettuce and a bell pepper. How I plan to eat this is kind of like some, you kind of wrap it. So for example, I take this little piece of lettuce here. I'm going to take some of the cauliflower and then a piece of beef. I'm going to wrap it up. <laughs> it's not well done, but... Mm-hmm.